Hey viewers, Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment, continuing my Lost and Damned walkthrough videos. This mission, Angels in America, is a basic chase down mission. The leader of the Lost, Billy, is insulted by a rival gang and causes some problems. It is up to Johnny and the rest of the Lost to chase down the angels and prevent them from spreading the word that a truce is off. You can see the tension building as Billy wants to go one direction with the Lost while Johnny feels there is a better way to do things. Like any chase mission in GTA, it ends up somewhere and you are better off riding out the mission. Little dorky gas station attendant boy goes, Hey man, are you alright? And I go, Yeah, dude, how's my bike? <laughs> <laughs> hey! Hey, Johnny K. Hey. Oh, hey. Hey. hey, Johnny, how you doing, baby? Hey! Oh, the fuck? Stop domestic violence. Hey, having fun over there? Absolutely. And if I get tested, I have a bag of 12 year old piss right here. <laughs> I am <laughs> real nice. Oh, fuck you, Johnny. You oh. don't judge me. Whoa, calm down, man. Have another drink or something, but calm the fuck down. Oh, hey, fuck watch your you mouth. Faggot, tell him. Yeah. Oh, really? Whoa, 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 guys, guys, Billy, Johnny. We got a couple of fucking deadbeats outside. Fuck dead what beats. fucking deadbeats? The hell they dead? Dead? What the fuck, fuck do they want? I'm out of rehab three minutes and they think they can crash yeah, my party? Right. Come on! Yeah, come on. Yeah, yeah, let's go! Do gotta do. Gentlemen, gentlemen! Why the long faces? Might I tempt you in a swift libation, my most trusted and honored guest? I thought we had a truce going. Did you? Funny thing, I wasn't aware. But let me tell you, it's a strange kind of truce that makes you think that it's okay to gate crash my party? Deadbeat, motherfucker. I'm sorry. <laughs> you enjoy your little party. I take it the good times are over. No problem, old man. Screw you, you deadbeat prick! Yeah, think you can come to my you. party and gate crash? Come on! Yeah, come on! This mission, you're using a sawed-off shotgun as you chase down the angels of death. Now, I don't see the reason for it. I mean, it's a close quarters weapon, and you got to get on top of the angels of death to shoot them, and they're shooting back. You're going to take some hits, and other gang members are going to be chasing the angels of death, like this guy, I just took down the guy on the back, and I'm riding next to him. There, I took him down. But there would have been a better off, maybe a submachine gun or something. But you got to keep pursuing the angels of death. And like any chase mission, it ends up somewhere, and it comes down to a gun battle, ultimately. So I'm going to fast forward through to that point because you never take down all of the angels of death. This is where the angels of death exit the highway and you follow them to the end here. And this is where having the carbine rifle is so much more advantageous. You can just shoot down the angels of death at a distance. Their weapons are less effective at a greater distance. And the carbine rifle is far more effective. And you can take them down, target them, and eliminate them in a quick fashion. Johnny, man. You let those deadbeats tell their buddies a war's on? No, I stopped them. 
We don't need more brothers dying over this. Sensible Johnny K. Come meet us over on Grummer Road, brother. If you had left your bike at the top of the air of the place where you jump off of, trying to walk up to it will cause your bike to be abandoned, and you have to start the mission over from the beginning. So you're better off jumping the bike, landing, taking down the lost or angels or whatever, angels of death, and now you have to go meet Billy somewhere. So I'm going to fast forward through the ride to where you meet up with Billy and the other lost members. Whew. Disaster averted, brother. Yeah. Coming back. Uh, I'd love to, man, but I'm seeing this hot Russian broad over on Firefly Island. I'm gonna drink a daddy's expensive vodka and fuck her under the pier. <laughs> Ooh. Young love in the modern world. Yeah. That's beautiful. Well, these dead beats won't be screwing around with us anymore. Let the good times roll. Mission accomplished. Auto save happening. Content is saved. Now. You can bring Johnny back to the clubhouse and do a hard save, or you can do what I'm going to do and ride around and arm up Johnny with more weapons and an armored vest where I can get a tactical shotgun and a vest right away, and then I can head to an area where if you have seen my previous GTA 4 videos about locations, and I'm talking the GTA 4 for um, Nico. There are places you can get carbine rifles, combat pistols, uh, assault shotguns, all kinds of more powerful weapons, which will help you out. And that is what I'm going to do after this mission. And again, Look at those videos. If you go to my GTA 4 um, list, you can search through and find them. This was a basic chase mission. A lot of fun. And actually, the storytelling for The Lost and the Damned was really good. And that's why I enjoyed this expansion pack. Um, I'm reminding you to please subscribe if you like this type of video if you just liked this video hit the like button i'm brad proprietor of barstool entertainment as always thanks for stopping by Between